I'm Renee, a Children's and Family Services Librarian at Marion Public Library, and I would like to tell you about a hilarious early chapter book called Sam Wu is Not Afraid of Ghosts by Kevin and Katie Sang. I'll read a little excerpt first. This event must never be spoken of ever again. Are you listening? Okay, good. It should have been the best day of the year. It was the day of the class field trip to the Space Museum. It was all I had thought about for months. You see, the Space Museum had a real spaceship in it. The only spaceship I'd ever seen was on my favorite TV show, Space Blasters. I was so excited, I even wore my special spaceman gear which was carefully crafted by Space Blaster's number one fan, i.e. me. Unfortunately, space gear is expensive, so I had to be resourceful and make my own even better space equipment. All it took was a bike helmet, some plastic wrap, and a few flashlights. It's dark in space. I even made a custom Space Blaster's shirt with some felt tip markers. I thought it was going to be a perfect day. I was wrong. Sam Wu's experience on a class field trip has left him embarrassed and searching for a way to prove to his classmates, especially his nemesis Ralph, that he's not a scaredy cat. Sam thinks the best way to do this is to get a snake, of course. If he can show his classmates that he has a dangerous animal as a pet, Sam knows he will redeem himself after that embarrassing event at the Space Museum. But a few days after Sam brings his snake, Fang, home, he finds the lid to Fang's enclosure open and Fang gone. Then Sam hears strange noises, like clanking and whistling in his house. Sam is certain there's a ghost in his house that let Fang out and is now haunting his family. This mystery sounds like something that Sam and his best friends will need to figure out. To find out if Sam and his friends solved the mystery of his missing snake and the scary sounds in his house, check out Sam Wu is Not Afraid of Ghosts, available in print format through Merriam Public Library. And if you love this book, try a few others about Sam, such as Sam Wu is Not Afraid of Sharks, and Sam Wu is not afraid of spiders. I'm sure you'll laugh about Sam's funny experiences as much as I did.